Hello, this is Stampy, and welcome to part number five of my Let's Play of Doki Doki Universe. Uh, I want to start off by saying a quick apology. Uh, in the last videos, I said about how regularly I was going to be uploading these. And yeah, if you've been following the series, you'll realise that I haven't been uploading them regularly. But it's not my fault. Don't have a go at me yet. Um, I basically had a problem with my game. Uh, when I bought it, I bought the limited edition, uh, which is supposed to come with the game and all of the day one DLC. Uh, but for some reason, it just didn't work. And the game like counted as if I only had the trial, uh, which is basically like a demo. And so yeah, that was basically why I couldn't go around to all of the other planets. And I had no idea why. I was emailing the developer and Sony and trying to get the game to work. But um, yeah, they couldn't fix it. They kept saying they would. Uh, but yeah, the, I basically just couldn't play the game. And there was nothing I could do. So I actually had to borrow a, uh, a spare PlayStation 3 of my friend Liam Ardo. Uh, so if you're watching this, Liam, thank you for your PlayStation. And then I had to sign in with um, someone else's account and actually buy the game again uh, in order to play it. And so basically what that means is I've had to start the game from the beginning. Uh, but don't worry, I'm not going to make you go and uh, uh, sit through me playing through all the, uh, the same stuff again. Uh, because I've basically gone through my old videos and watched back to try and do everything exactly the same. So hopefully now we should be ready to, to carry on and uh, just keep on playing from where we were. And so for you, uh, it should be as if nothing's happened. But um, I did just want to warn you that that is a problem. Uh, I know I'm not the, the only person that had that problem. And it should be finished now. Um, it should be all sorted out. Uh, but if you are buying this game, just do be wary that for me, I had to buy the game twice just to play it. And um, I've not been given a refund for the first game. So uh, the developer were great. Uh, I don't think it's a problem with them. I think it was Sony's store. And uh, the developer was great replying to emails and that. Uh, Sony wasn't. They replied a little bit, then kind of gave off me so um yeah just do be warned if you're buying this game uh, that there is a very small chance that um yeah you might not actually be able to play it but that doesn't matter i can play it now we're back where we left off and uh, we can carry on having fun and uh, i've been looking forward to playing this game for so long after uh, having several weeks not being able to play it so uh, we can carry on look we can actually go to to other planets now i can go to uh Su Suteki, Suteki, there we go, let's go down to Suteki and we can actually go and um, do some, some more missions rather than just loads of quizzes. Because I do love the quizzes, but I think, um, yeah, too many in a row, they get boring. I'm going to uh, switch between doing quizzes. What I think I'll do is uh, each um, video I'll do a planet and then once I've finished the planet I'll maybe go and do like one or two quizzes just to, to end off the videos. Anyway, it uh, looks like, uh, was it Jeff I think the alien was called? It's been a while since I've played this now, I'm going to have to get back into it again. On this planet, you will test your ability to understand two things that are very human. Trust and self-sacrifice. There's going to be a quiz after this, so pay attention. I will. Good. I'll be bummed if they have to turn you all into... Well, if they turn you and all of your relatives into scrap metal. Oh, no. Cheer up. I was only kidding. I hope. <laughs> See ya! Oh, he's a jolly little fella, isn't he? I guess this is a, um, I guess this is like Japan, do you reckon? Uh, certainly looks like Japan. Look, there's a, there's a big old sumo wrestler wandering around there. Uh, this lady here seemed to have a, a mission for me. And can you see that that not very well hidden uh, present behind there? What have I got? I got, oh, I got a cat! Yay! That's good. Uh, anyway, let's go uh, speak to her. Hey! Hey! Um, hi, you're a robot, aren't you? Yes, I am model QT3776665. Huh? <gasps> QT3! You are QT3? Yes, do you know me? There was a girl here once, many years ago. She talked about you. Her name was Lanny. Lanny? Oh, is, is that that little girl? Is that is that the his, uh, his old family member? She was a teenager. Can you tell me more, please? Where is Lanny? Maybe later. Right now, I'm too worried. Um, okay, we need to find out why she's worried, I guess. I'm looking for my little friend, Ebi Sushi. <laughs> I look after her and the other sushi. Can you help me? Maybe ask her to come back? Yes, I will help you. Okay, we need to go get the go get the sushi ones. Which one is it? Is it this guy? Right, so we've got to pick them up and fling them, I guess. I'm going to try and do it relatively gently. Uh, how do I do it? There we go. Oh, that wasn't very gently, was it? <laughs> Looks like they enjoyed it. What a fun game. Right, I guess we've got to get all the, the sushi to her then. Uh, press triangle to access the player menu. Uh, scanning shows you uh, where the presents are. NPCs still have presents. Yeah, yeah, I know all this stuff. Well, if the sushi's all right here, do I just have to move it a little bit closer to her? Um, how do I, how do I actually fling them? Can I fling them gently at all? 
Um, there we go. <laughs> Luckily, they all seem to be uh, enjoying it. And oh, look, got a, a couple more presents there. I didn't even mean to pick up that house, but I'm glad I did. All right, let's pick up this guy. If we try and bounce him, hopefully he's not going to go too far. There we go. Managed to get the sushi back. Oh, we didn't like it, though. Uh, maybe I could take her to the sushi. I can see a few more presents around here. Is there a guy behind here? Look, can you see behind the house? I could just see a few little legs poking out. Oh, there he is. There's the little sushi fella. Let's speak to him. Appy says to stop hiding. I don't want to be eaten. I've got some, some grubs. Is it true? Am I food? Oh, what should I say? Uh, of course not. You're not food. Uh, but you look so cute and yummy. Sushi is food, but I won't eat you. Oh, what do I say then? Because should I lie and make him feel better? But I suppose he needs to know the truth. I mean, if you're food, you got to know. Um, but you look so cute and yummy. <laughs> oh, can I do that or is that a bit mean? I'm going to say you are sushi is food, but I won't eat you. Aha, I am a thinker. Sushi is food, but I won't eat you. Really? You won't? No, I do not eat. I am a robot. Oh, I'm so relieved. <laughs> Yay. Let's give my sushi a hug. Uh, thank you, robot. There we go. He's relieved. Okay, well, let's go try and take her back there. No, he can't go back there. Why not? Humans are scary. They eat sushi. Who told you that? Who's that? Uh, Dorama did. It's the truth. He said I'm going to get eaten. And the other sushi are too. What? We're food? I heard that. Eek. I better get to the bottom of this. Where is Dorama? He's over there. We better hide from the humans. Yeah. I'm too young to get eaten. <laughs> well, where's the Dorama guy then? Is that is that the big sushi guy? I suppose if someone's going to talk about eating food, I suppose it's pretty likely it would be him. There's a lot of hidden presents all over here, though, isn't there? I think there's, there's all. Sorry, mate. Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Let me just let me just plonk you down over there. Sorry. <laughs> that was weird. And uh, yeah, behind here, I think there's two presents. There we go. Okay, loads of presents in these places. Like you can use the presents to um, get stickers and stuff to decorate your home world. Uh, some characters will give you presents when they're friendly. Some characters surrender presents when they hate you. I don't want to make anyone hate me. I don't want to be mean to anyone. Got myself a drum kit though. Where's this? Um, where's this Dorama then? Uh, there's that woman there I've already spoke to. Oh, here he is. <laughs> da rule ma. Da rule ma. Hello. Why did you tell Ebi Sushi that she is fooled? You get right to the point, don't you? Yes, I am programmed that way. Can you please explain? I will fill you in, but I want something first. Okay, what do you want? Money, shiny, wonderful cash money. All right. Let's go get him some shiny cash money then. Maybe uh, one of these one of these presents has some shiny cash money. Oh look, he's thinking of a Catwoman. <laughs> uh, no, that's not any cash money. There's presents behind pretty much everything. Like if you just walk around, just picking everything up and dropping it, you just get money all over the place. Uh, I got I got an ant an ant with a drum kit. Uh, I got some. I think that might be some more sushi there. Um, there's a whole load of more presents here. Let's open all of these up. Oh, no, I don't want to speak to you. Sometimes it's a bit awkward trying to choose what like what you're doing if you're speaking let me just move this sushi out the way because he's completely in the way then i should be able to get the present there we go i got a bit of food uh i got some more food uh, i got some some vines there we go i got another present behind here i guess if i just keep going around there we go i got some money only five but still got some nice cash monies and uh there we go this icon means that the character has a goal for you or something important to say this icon means the character has a reminder to give you Okay, let me just keep walking around until I get back to that, whatever that guy's name was, Duramur or whatever it was. And yeah, then I can give him the uh, the cash monies that I found. Not that he deserves it. Right, let's, um, I think I go to this. And then I need to go find the cash monies, which is here. There you go. Enjoy your money, sir. Oh, God, look at him. <laughs> God, he's going to crack himself. What even is he? Is he like an egg? Or is he, is he like a, a really short guy in a sleeping bag or something, maybe? <laughs> oh, well, I got some dust bunnies from it. Money! Now that's what I'm talking about. I'm rich. I'm actually not worth that much. Oh, who cares, money? I love money. And, um, I guess I love you too. Sort of. Um, so... Oh, right, EB Sushi. Let's go talk to Irupi. 
Okay. <laughs> I love the way the money talks. Like, I'm not actually worth that much, just to let you know. Uh, is this the is this the person I'm supposed to speak to, or is it or is it the the sushi? Um, I should see a doctor. What's wrong with him? Uh, I, I guess I need to go try and find the sushi. Is, is that guy still following me? Um, or is he always or is he just gone to stay at this lady? I'm not sure if I'm supposed to speak to her or the sushi. Uh, let, let's speak to this woman. I brought Dorama. The sushi won't come. <gasps> what? The other sushi have run away too now? Hey, Erpy. Dorama, did you do something to scare Ebi and the other sushi? Hey, it's not my fault. I just told her that people eat sushi. And that sumo is sick and could use some food. That's all. Oh, that's all? Oh, yeah. And I might have said that eating Ebi sushi is especially healthy. Dorama. Well, it's true. What shall I do? I can't force them to come back if they're scared of me. Dorama, I'm going to kill you. Hey, I'm out of here. QT3, have you got any ideas? Um, I could fling them over here. That, <laughs> well, I suppose that would get them here. That's that's one way of doing it. Uh, let's ask a wise monk. Maybe we just need some soy sauce. <laughs> I love the, the joker option. Let's just eat them. There we go. Problem solved. Then they're not going to be scared. If they're eaten, they're not going to be scared because they're already eaten. You're not going to be scared of being eaten if you're already eaten. You know, it's like being like pricking your finger with a pin. You're not going to be scared of pricking your finger with a pin if you've already done it. I mean, it still hurts, but <laughs> the chances of it happening again is pretty unlikely. And let's ask a wise monk, shall we? Aha, I am a team player. Wait, wait, where's an old monk then? Let's ask some wise old monk for our advice. Oh, Master Zen, I didn't think of him. Hey, you're a smart robot. She's very impressed. That's why I get the big bucks. <laughs> huh? Sorry, I was attempting a human joke. Oh, um, whatever. Maybe Master Zen will know what to do. I'll wait here in case the sushi come back. You go and ask Master Zen, okay? Okay. Right, let's go. Let's go speak to Master Zen. Have we seen him? I'm not sure if I, I think I might have seen him around here somewhere. Uh, let's go try and track him down and see if he can uh, give us any advice for how to get the the sushi back. And oh, oh there's, there's a sushi here. He's he's got a little mission. Let's speak to him. Let's see what he's got to say. Hi, nice robot. Can I ask you for something? Sure, Wasabi. What is it? Um, it's embarrassing. That's okay. I'm feeling kind of down. Would you blow me a kiss? Sure, I can do that. Blow a kiss to the... Oh, God. Only in this game would a mission be talk to a sushi. The sushi's feeling down, so blow the sushi a kiss. Uh, you collect two different types of things. You collect summonables, uh, things you can summon, and you collect decorations for your home planet. Fantastic. Right, how did I blow kisses again? I think it was... I think wave. I think it was in a circle. I had to use it. There we go. Thanks, QT3. That makes me feel much better. <laughs> Anytime. Uh, Anytime, Wasabi. I have lots of kisses. You're nice. Ah, oh, I'm loved by the little bit of sushi. I want a pet sushi. <laughs> Jeff, you want to surprise your parents when they ask you like what you want for your birthday or whatever? Say you want a pet sushi and see what see see how they respond. <laughs> anyway, let's go speak to. Was it Master Zen? Was this guy called? I have come to ask. Yes, I know already. Oh, right, because you are wise and an enlightened monk. I bet he's going to say, no, I overheard you. No, I heard you. You and Erapi were just over there. Oh. So, here's what you do. Go find Ebi Sushi. Ask her and the sushi to follow you to the Sumasun. Tell them to hide and just watch. Why? You'll see. While the sushi are watching, give this to the sumo-san. It looks just like the sushi. That's the idea. Go on now, find EB, then go to sumo-san. Okay. <laughs> awesome. I'm not, I got, I got, so I got I leveled up, so I got some new stuff. I got a new avatar. And uh, look, I got a new steed. I got a big well. I don't know if it's going to replace my... um replace my cheese, but it's still pretty cool. Anyway, I'm not entirely sure what I'm doing here, but I need to speak to Ebi Sushi, whatever this guy is. Hi, Ebi Sushi. Hey, Maki. Hi, Wasabi. Hey, QT3. Are they still trying to eat us? Follow me, okay? Hide and watch and see what happens. Okay, if you say so. Come on, Maki. Come on, Wasabi. 
I'm coming. Me too. <laughs> oh, dude, their voices change absolutely every single time, but it doesn't matter. It's still easier than you having to read it. So I need to go to the um, go to the sumo wrestler and give him that sticker. Maybe if I give him the sticker, he's gonna be all like, "Ooh, I don't want them." So let's go to him and let's go try and find the the picture of the the sushi. Can you see it anywhere? I can't see it anywhere around here. Can you? Maybe I, I need to I need to speak to him first and then give it to him. Or maybe I just couldn't see. Oh well, let's go say hi anyway. I've not actually spoke to him yet, and I got some grubs from it. Ooh, I'm not feeling so good. Master Zen asked me to give you this sushi. Sushi, huh? Um, okay, now, now what? Let's speak to him again then, I guess. Didn't you say you were giving me something from Zen? Oh, okay, right. Now I can give it to him. There we go. I can see it over here on the left, just underneath the toilet. <laughs> Don't know if that's very hygienic. Whoa, God, look at him. He's pretty... Pretty nimble for a sumo wrestler. <laughs> there you go. Zen says it's a snack for you. Hi, we are the real sushi. We are not fake. <laughs> uh, sushi? Yummy, 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 yummy. We are so delicious. Yummy, 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 yummy. Put me inside your tummy. <laughs> That's disgusting. Stop joking around. Don't you want to eat us? Yum, yum, yum. Hey, robot, what's going on? I would never eat my friends. Never? Never! Never, never. Never, never, never! I guess you don't need this fake sushi anymore. Here, P, can you come over so we can talk? Coming! <laughs> uh, so I guess, I guess I basically wanted the sushi to see that he would never eat them. Of course not, they're all friends. Hi, hi everyone. <laughs> right, let's, let's go speak to, to this woman again. I can't believe it! Those poor little sushi! That darned drama! Yeah. I'm glad you're helping, QT3. I don't know what we'd do otherwise. She's very thankful. Good. Hopefully she's going to give me a present. I love the way I'm doing everything just to get presents. I'm not just trying to be nice and help them. I'm just doing it all for the presents. I will do my best. Sumo-san, the sushi were afraid you wanted to eat them. What? Are you guys worried about that? No, not anymore. I'm embarrassed. Me too. Sorry, Sumo-san. I would never hurt you. I love you guys. So do I. Oh, I don't feel well. <laughs> sumo son, are you all right? Oh, I think so, EB. You can eat me if you want. Maybe you'll get well. You can eat me too. And me. <laughs> That's sweet, guys, but nobody's eating anybody. <laughs> I wouldn't mind a little sushi. <laughs> Shut up, Dorman. I'm kind of hungry, though. Robot, can you hook me up with some healthy food? Yes, I can do that. <laughs> oh, God, it's all going crazy. Look, everyone's got presents for me now. I've helped them enough. They're all going to give me some presents. What am I going to get? Oh, I get a um, a, a Japanese-looking lady. And from the sushi, I'm going to get a... Oh, a, um, a Japanese-looking building. Awesome. I guess I could have a little Oriental-styled area. Uh, so what do I need to do? That I need to I need to get him something healthy. Did I get any healthy food at all? Um, we could give him a hot dog. We could give him a piece of poop. We could give him some ketchup. Uh, we could give him the sushi again. See how he responds. I think this is it. I think that looks like to be some sort of salad, some sort of boring lettuce. Oh god! <laughs> they all jumped up in shock as I passed the salad. <laughs> there we go. Is this is this gonna be okay? Oh, that looks perfect. He looks very satisfied. I'm feeling better already. There we go. There's proof that you need to eat your greens. QT3, you've been such a great help. Thank you. Well, now she's even more thankful as well. Sorted. There's still a few more missions left. I think there's still four more missions for me to do yet. I got three goals uh, not yet discovered uh, on this planet. So I guess if I go around, I think that this woman had another goal for me as well as the, the evil looking guy. Anyway, let's go speak to her and see what, what else she wants me to do. I don't mean to bother you. I know what you're going to ask about Lanny. Yes. Do you know where she is? Well, I can't tell you much. She said that she was looking for some robot. I am a robot. Oh, wait. She did say something about a planet with broken robots or something. I'm sorry. I wish I could remember more. That's okay. I am very happy. Would it be appropriate for me to hug you? Um, yes, uh, very. Mm. Oh, here we go. We're going in for a hug. Ah. 
I sure like you. Oh, she loves me. <laughs> hey, me too. Oh, the sushi loves me as well. Am I going to give the sushi a big hug as well? You can see just the fish balancing on top of it. Ah, what a nice moment between the robot cat, the Japanese woman, and the sushi. <laughs> Everyone loves me. Anyone going to give me a present? Do I get a present out of this? I mean, that's what friends are for. Getting presents out of them. You're the best. Have this. Yay! A bendy tree. Fantastic. Uh, it looks like she's got another mission for me already. Cutie free. can I ask for a go? Ask for a favour before you go? Sure. Well, I want to surprise Eevee with a gift. What would you like? She loves manga. You know, colourful comic books. Can you make me a colourful book? Okay. Make a colourful book, manga. Um... Let me, let me just see if I've got one. I might, I might just have one on me. I think I picked up quite a lot of presents around here. Can you see a colourful book? Maybe if I, I combined the flamingo with a normal book, that might make it extra colourful. Um, I, I don't seem to I don't seem to, to have any anything sort of colourful. I don't even really know how to, to make things. Uh, let me speak to this guy, because he seems to have a mission for me as well. Maybe I'm going to find it just from this anyway. Hey, robot! Yes? I magically, I magical myself, so I really don't need to ask you, but... Hmm? But I love Japanese drums. Can you make me some? Sure, I can do that. Why are we helping this guy? He was mean. I think I got Japanese drums anyway. I'm all... I mean to pick him up though. But as soon as he's mean, so I just fire him up into the sky. Woo! <laughs> oh, yeah, he actually enjoys it. That wasn't a punishment to him. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I found some drums, didn't I? Where there's... I mean, there's a few drums. There's these ones... With the little lamp playing them. And then these ones up here. Um, I'm guessing these ones are the, the more Japanese ones. Uh, so let me try and give that to him. See if he enjoys it. I love the way they jump up. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, I love Tico drums. I love it. Hey, you going to give me a present? Are you going to give me a present now? He's very pleased. I'm glad you like it. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> anyway, there seems to be a few more missions for me uh, left to do here. Uh, sadly, uh, we have just about run out of time in this episode though. Uh, so don't worry, uh, I am going to now, now the game's working, I am now going to be trying to uh, upload more regularly than I was before. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Uh, I certainly had a, a lot of fun here. And so in the next video, I'm going to finish off the, uh, the last few missions here, uh, maybe go do some more quizzes, and then visit a new planet. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you all later. Bye!